Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Journey of Life. Uh, as, as you can see, it's the morning, and I'm just cutting up some morning wood, like I uh, usually do. Uh, I've got some small planks, going, some small one meter logs in here, so I can make one meter planks. Uh, what I've been doing is I've been actually trying to clean up the beach there. It's been a bit of a mess. We'll turn this off for now. Uh, not that it really matters, not like we're wasting power or anything. Uh... I was actually thinking about these vertical connectors, or these horizontal connect connectors, if I'm actually going to be able to go vertical. I don't think it's actually possible to have a windmill up there and the power stuff inside on the bottom floor, but uh, I'll maybe look into that at some point in time. Uh, as you can see, I am thirsty again, and I've been thinking about getting into the water collector. Uh, but anyways, let's go in here and uh, check out a huge pile of wood here. Wow. Oh, I do not want those. Ah, whatever. Uh, but what I've been doing is I've been making some more box, uh, more uh, plank chests, these things here, and uh, that's actually not too bad. That's not what I want to do. I'm going to here. Uh, the reason being is I actually want to try to start gathering up stuff off the beach because I got so many entities down there. Well, I don't think it really matters, but uh, you know, just to try to clean up the place. So in that way, if I ever want to build down there, I don't have all this junk in the way and whatnot. Uh, I think I have enough to build what I could build three more. Okay. Uh, just like so. Uh, I already have one entire box full of the palm leaves. I have no idea what we use them for. I'm hoping that we could use them for something because I have a lot of them and I still have another whole box to fill up. Uh, what I've been doing too is uh, what I'll do is I'll actually move, take the chest and I'll build it and I'll move it down like I was doing with the mine. Run down here and just fill it up with everything that's on the ground and so on and so forth. And I can't wait until they actually start getting bigger, bigger storage. So as you can see, it's starting to look a little better here. But uh, as you can see by my little end menu here, there's tons of these things everywhere. And I've been cutting down all these trees and I got all these palm leaves everywhere and all that other stuff. Uh, speaking of which, while we're here, uh, these things here, I want to grab some of those leaves. And uh, I try not to have that on because it confuses me. Because I always think my inventory is open when I see that. But I want to try to get to this water collector. Let's actually take care of this first. Uh, having that sawmill is going to be so much easier. Uh, we may end up upgrading this place to planks. I'm not too sure. Uh, oh, yeah, water collector. Let's see what we need for this thing. Uh, seeing as how we have easy planks, then I want to try to get some stuff going. Like, I'd like to get a bed going. Uh, we'll need cloth, which means we'll need to get to, to the loom, which is somewhere down here. Uh, I'm sure I passed it. Lathe, turning rack, cloth weaver, there we go. Which is fiber rope and planks, which is not too bad. Uh, that's why I'm cleaning up the beach, because I got so much stuff down there. I might as well use it, right? Anyway, for the water collector, let's see what I actually need here. I know I need some of those leaves are here. Now it says collects water on rainy days. I have not seen it rain so I don't know if this is actually going to work or not. Uh, I've already made the clay funnel. Just need seven leaves and nine rope. So let me gather that up and I'll be right back. Okay I have everything ready. I've got the rope all made up. Uh, so now i got to find that clay funnel. Where if I put it? Uh, I'm surprised I still have that owl. I haven't done anything with it yet. What did I do with that clay funnel? I know I had one here somewhere. I don't have any chests on the beach anymore. Uh, oh well, we'll make another one. I had some clay here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Just happens to be in the clay chest. Go figure. Okay, now I have absolutely no idea. This thing is even going to work. Like I said, I have not seen any rain, so let's find out. Well, yeah, let's put it right here. Perfect. Uh, I guess we'll put it out here somewhere. What did I have? Oh yeah, I moved the fireplace. Uh, yeah, that monstrosity. We'll just put it there for now. Again, I have absolutely no idea how this thing works, what it does. This is all new to me. And... to place an item. What am I missing? Oh, I need a, I need sticks. Uh, do 
I have an inventory space. No, I do not. I'll just put that there on the floor. Okay, I need sticks. There should be some sticks somewhere. If I were a stick, I would be probably outside. Yeah. Get the old end menu up. And we'll go run off into the bush. And somewhere around here. Oop. There we go. I'll pick those up. Get rid of that so I'm not confused. There we go. Alright, so let me get up here and have a look at this thing. So do I have to put something underneath? I think I do, actually. What did I do with my uh, water jugs? That is a good question. Hmm, let me look for my things. Hang on. I found them. They were on the on the beach here. They say they got water in them, but they don't. Uh, speaking of water, probably should take care of that before I can... something happens. Uh, I cut down a tree here, so there should be lots of coconuts. Come on, give me a few more. Come on. Gotta be some more around here. Oh, what was that? No, oh, it's a leaf. Uh, another tree over here. And no coconuts. Oh well. It'll keep me alive for now. Oh, there's uh, one right here. Oh. Okay. The vitals have sustained. And I missed. Ow. My shins are going to be beaten up by the end of this. I got to put a ramp here or extend the platform or pave the area or something. So that goes there. Right? how this works. Oh wait, hold on, what's this? And it seems to be working. Interesting. I have a better look at this. See if I get this thing in the right spot. Apparently I do, because it's saying that. I just matter if it actually raining. Uh, so anyways, that is going there. Uh, what I will do is I'm going to get a whole bunch of rope made up. Actually, I think I just need one more. Uh, let's get this loom, or this uh, cloth weaver. Yeah, I'll do the cleaning off camera. Uh, let's see if I have any fibers. Probably not. Uh, I'm sure I got a whole bunch outside. They're everywhere. I really do gotta clean up the area. Okay, and you know, I just realized now. I was trying to. F I didn't really notice until just this moment that the number next to the plank storage on the nearby and in the inventory tells you how many planks are actually in there. Yeah, uh, took me a little bit to figure that one out. That rap looks kind of funny. Anyway, uh, we're going to make some rope. Go ahead and make, uh, I'll just make a whole bunch of rope. Why not? So I'm going to go over here. And let's get into the cloth weaver. Which is somewhere down here. Okay, and I need planks. And I think we're actually going to put this upstairs. I don't think it actually needs power. Uh, I'll use, use the space that I have here, right? And let's put it right here, I think. Alright, i got to go grab another plank. Which is going to be eeny, meeny, miny, mo. i got planks everywhere. Before it was like trouble, trouble just kept trying to get the planks that I needed. Now I've got so many planks, I don't know which way to go to find Anyway, let's have a look at this loom. Lighting would definitely be a good thing, and the only thing I could think of right now is... Um, 
setting up a campfire up here. There's supposed to be a way you could put the torches on the walls, but I haven't figured that out yet. So there we go. Oh, that's good. So instead of one rope for one fiber, now I get two rope for one fiber. And the cloth is five rope. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's check this thing out. Uh, let's see here. Let me uh, find some fibers and I'll be right back. Okay, I got a whole bunch. I got a little over two stacks. And it's funny. I go and build a water collector and for some reason now I actually have... Well, I've Clouds are darker than usual. It actually looks like it's going to rain. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. We're going upstairs. We're going to go upstairs and check out this loom or this cloth weaver. And let's see here. It'd be nice if there was an animation. But there is not. All right. So that is rope. So now we can go ahead and make some cloth. Sure, we'll make four. I think we only need two for the bed. I think I'll just scatter things all over the place. So that is that. Uh, what else could we get into? I know there's a tanning rack. I, th I wonder if there, I think there's supposed to be a water skin or something that holds more water. We'll check that out in just a minute here. This last piece, last piece of cloth is finished crafting. There we go. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, and needs more planks. Too. Oops. That's the wrong way. All right. Let's see what we need for a bed. Get off the floor. I need four planks. Okay. One, two. Oops. Okay, yeah, okay. I thought I, my inventory was full. Okay, we go here. And now we actually have a bed. Which means I can get rid of that grass mat on the floor. I wouldn't even call that a sleeping bag because it's not even a bag. It's just... Honestly, I'd probably be more comfortable just laying all the fibers on the ground. Okay, and... Just because I want to put it in the corner. Just like that to be different. I know I should hotkey my hammer, but I'm always taking stuff out of my inventory, so I'm always changing it. Alright. Okay, so the cloth is for the pillow, apparently. Cool. That is that. Alright, what else can we build? I'm going on a building spree today. Uh, let's see. Uh, pottery. I do have clay. Uh, not ready for the forge yet. Or crushing steam. Well, that's old stuff. Uh, it's going to be a power crusher, if anything. Uh, it's going to be iron and all that stuff, which means we might have to go check out that mine. I should go build that elevator. That's for making barrels. Uh, which is right there. Iron hoop we need the anvil for, which, again, we don't really need. And that's a long ways away. And then this, I have no idea what this does. You know what? Let's, let's check it out. I know I got feathers out here inside here somewhere. Been uh, wondering about that for a while. And where's that feather? There we go. I'm sure some of you already know, but hey, I'd like to find out myself, and I'm thirsty again. But anyways, we'll deal with that in just a second. I want to see what this is all about. Oh, is this actually a research station? What is this? Drawing table. Oh, wait, I think I know what this is. I think this is about uh, creating blueprints of structures and rebuilding them. Construction plan recipe.
Let's have a look at that, shall we? I'm sure it's going to be under craftables. Used for... Maps? Ooh. Ooh. And don't worry if I do, let's check this out. And I'm going to guess we do this. Furnace, fireplace, pickup. Hmm. How do we make a map? Let's check this up now for just a sec. Furnace and fireplace. Oh, research. I'm sorry, what is this? Give me a second here. Okay, so I, I figured it out. What the blueprint really is, is being able to craft things that you need in the workbench without actually needing the workbench. So that way you carry the blueprint with you and you can go uh, you can go ahead and craft this. As far as researching goes, I don't know what is really going on. Like I'm thinking we might have to, that's the wrong page. See, every crafting bench adds new recipe. Upgrade adds new recipe. Can even upgrade this? You can't. I still don't know what they mean about maps, but let's go ahead and try building another one of these. I don't think I have everything on me that I need. No. So let me get that and I'll be right back. That was quick. It was all in one chest behind me. Anyway, we're down here and craft another one of these. At least this is what I think we're supposed to be doing. It says every. You get that. that. Uh, like every one. Uh, ultimately I figured out the water collector. I think I need to keep a container underneath and then use another con container to fill it up because I wasn't getting that prompt. But now it's showing up. But let's see what this actually does. I thought I had enough sticks on me. Oh, wait, I think my hammer bugged out. Nope. I thought I had enough sticks. It was only 10, was it not? Oh, and, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. It's the bugged out hammer that does it to me. Okay, I know I got some more sticks around here somewhere. Uh, yeah, let me find them. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So let's let's see what happens. Okay. Now I don't have enough on me. Well, I've got paper already, so let me see if I can got any fibers kicking around here. I don't think I do. Might have to go run outside. And no. Oh, I do. Okay. There he goes over. Run back over here. Go back to craftables. Make some more paper. And as soon as it gives it to me, see if we get something else here. No, just furnace and fireplace. Uh, I still don't know what I, how I'm supposed to actually research stuff. It says research progress. Let me actually look into this. I'll be right back. Oh, okay, I looked into it. It's not actually implemented yet. It's basically, like I said, just for uh, remotely building stations like the fireplace and the smelter, which is the only thing that's available right now. But another thing I can do is uh, we can get into the pottery wheel or the pottery and see how this at all works. So I need 20 sticks and a pottery wheel. And a pottery wheel would be in here somewhere, which I need two stone wheels and a large, so I need like 
21 large sticks and two flat rocks. So let me find those and I shall return. Okay, I got everything. I'm just crafting up the wheels now. And then we'll craft up the pottery wheel. And then we go to our stations. And then uh, I think I passed already. Yeah, it's way up here. And then we place. Now I don't think this actually needs power. Hmm. Nah, we'll just put it over here in the backyard. Uh, that's something I gotta do with between now and the next episode is get a, go and mine a whole bunch of limestone. It's gonna take forever. Uh, something I actually wanted to do today was get into the ore crusher to see if that would actually grind the limestone. Uh, the problem is though is I need iron for that and I've got a couple of ingots but I got one nugget and that's it. But anyways, let's see what this is all about. Be nice if it built it a little bit quicker instead of one piece at a time. Oh, we're almost done. Three, two, one. Okay, okay, small clay pot. Yeah, we got that. Uses less clay. Nice. You know how? Ooh, this might be something interesting. Getting to clay and stuff. So I have a bottle, and I'm just gonna guess that that's what I'm talking about. Maybe a clay cup as well. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so that is the pottery wheel. I like it. Definitely got to get a better foundation. Other than that, I think that's about all we can do. Like I said, I wanted to even look at the ore crusher today, but. Uh, we need 10 iron gears. I have no idea how many, how much iron I need for one gear. I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess one nugget, but I have one nugget. I have no ore to actually cook or process or anything like that. I don't think I have anything in the furnace. That's not the furnace. It is the furnace. Nothing. And we got one nugget. We got th three ingots. I can't do anything with them. We got the hatchet head too. Which means I'm going to have to go back to the cave and do some mining, but uh, I'm going to take that blueprint with me and I'm probably going to drop a couple of uh, um, those things in there. Uh, same time too, I'm going to try to get some clean up done around, around the area and maybe even do some organization. Uh, one of the things I will do is I'm going to get all these things on box, on shelves I should say. And what I'll do is on the shelf, I'll actually place the item right there, so at least we can see it. Maybe not even shelves, but uh, we can get a table. Helps if I hit the right button here. Go into the furniture, and we can go back to those big shelves, big tables that we had. Oh, not really big, but you know, I may use this, and then we can actually use this as shelves. Put the crates on top. And then have the item either in front or beside or somewhere. But that'll be in the next one because uh, we're running along and I clearly wasn't prepared for anything here. And uh, yeah, I'm going to have to get into the habit of turning that off. But anyways, I think this going to be it for this one. I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later. Well, I was going to end it here, that's why I think there's uh, the unusual cut that I normally don't have in my videos. Uh, but one, there is one other thing I was looking at now. I think we should actually look into this because uh, I think that's what those palm leaves might be used for. Uh, going to stations, we're going to get into composting. So then at least that way I can start growing food. Uh, I've heard rumors that things may, not, may or may not be growable. We'll find out. But uh, let me grab up these resources and I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. That was actually pretty pretty easy, especially when somebody leaves all that stuff just laying on the beach, just carelessly cutting down trees and leaving everything behind. <clears throat> yeah, we won't talk about that. Anyway, uh, compost. Where are you? Down here. Okay, so let's go put this outside somewhere. Let's put it on the back porch, actually. As we've got the ore crusher out front, we'll put the compost in the back. Um, oh, 
Hammer broke. Ha ha ha. Uh, what hammer? handle do I have on here? Basic hammer handle. Alright, well, let's uh, go fix my hammer, shall we? I think I had some more logs over here. I do. Oh, I already cut. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, run over the lathe. Our high tech equipment here. Basic camera handle. Oh, and it uses a block too. That's what, something I want to try to get into too. Is yeah, not gonna work. As I know, you can use st have stuff crafting behind you, so or have stuff behind you in your craft. Oh, it's a rock. So I can have like pile of logs here, and I just go up to here and craft it, no problem. Must be a short handle if we're using a block for it, not a one meter log. Okay, uh, let's go here. Let's actually get the right tool out. And take the handle, the head off. This will be firewood probably. And go back here and like that. I actually really enjoy how that's done. Need some fine tuning. I'd li like it to be able to hang parts and tools off the pegboard on the back of the table. But if this works with those plants or the palm leaves, then maybe we can start getting into some farming next episode. But that water collector's got to work. And let's actually see if it's doing anything. That's not doing anything. Uh, but yeah, I noticed that. No, that's not what I want to do. If you have it down there, don't get any prompt. This is what I was having trouble with. But as soon as you put a container in your hand, then I'll say, take liquid or pick up. So, take liquid. But there is nothing in there because it's not raining. So, I don't know if that's actually going to work or not. Anyways, uh, yeah, we're going to go over here and check out the, the composter. So, I think these are what this is for. It is. So, it can hold 50. Hmm. It's a good thing I cut down all those palm trees, huh? Alright, let's fill this up and see how long it takes to actually make the compost. I'm um, thinking you might actually have to fill it all the way up for it to work. Again, I have no idea. I've never even built this thing until now. One, two, and three. The best thing is I have so much down there on the beach, too. Alright, so... I guess we let it sit and do its thing. And then maybe in the next episode we get to some farming. I know I have seeds everywhere. There's apparently mango plant seeds that I have, but I don't know if they actually work or not. I've heard rumors that may it may or may not be working. But yeah, so we have farm plots here. We have a one farm plot, a four slot plot, or an eight slot part. And the best thing is there are seeds everywhere. Right there we have red berry seeds, which I might have to do because these berry plants aren't growing back. And I wonder if it's got to do with the fact that it never rains here. I don't know, but I got all these berry bushes around and I got no berries on them. So that's how I've been living off of coconuts. Fortunately, this isn't stranded deep, and stranded deep, you'll actually die if you eat too many coconuts. Oh! I do not see those berries there. Unfortunately, they don't show up in your inventory. Or not your inventory, uh, the nearby. I might have to bring that up as a bug. Look at all that food that we're wasting. Anyway, uh, I'm going to call this one here, uh, finally. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. That will keeps staring me in the face. I go looking around for these things, and it just happens to be right here. But yeah, anyways, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.